Hello, I'm Sarah Scott, and welcome to LUTV Sports Break, where we will discuss interesting sports topics with our panel of sports reporters. This postseason for the National Basketball Association starts this weekend. After a regular season filled with great performances by great players, there are two in the mix for receiving this year's Most Valuable Player Award. Milwaukee's Giannis Antetokounmpo averaged just over 27 points per game, grabbing 12 boards, and has led the Bucks to the number one seed in the Eastern Conference. Last year's MVP, Houston's James Harden, led, this league, led the league in scoring with 36 points per game. Panel, who will win the award for this season, the Greek Freak or the Beard? The Beard, of course. Giannis is really young, he has a lot to do. He has a, a mid-range he needs to develop ASAP, but I just see James getting it because he has a more complete game. There's no holes in his offense, even though he doesn't play any defense, but none well, of the league Well, actually, does. his defense has actually improved a lot this season. But sure. it's still not but worse. That's not good for James Harden. An improvement so. on defense when you don't play defense at all. at all is not great defense. Well, he was, like, leading the league in, I think it was, uh, deflections at one point. He's leading the league and not playing defense. At all. Yeah, at all. And Giannis plays defense, and he has a good game. I think if he develops a little longer, then he'll be the MVP. But not right now because James Harden is doing everything for his team. He's so valuable to his team. Without Giannis, the Bucks will be okay. They're in the yeah. East. They don't have Super that. easy conference. Yeah, they don't Super have a hard pass. Oh, yeah. But if James God. Harden is so valuable to his team, why can't he win a final? Did you final? take James Harden away from the Rockets? The Rockets are going downhill. It's to your point, James Harden is the regular season MVP. He's not like the, you know, playoff MVP. That's why we just That's wait until the finals. Up. Of course, no. He gets to the playoffs and he freezes, but yeah, regular season that. MVP is James Harden. Now, I when feel. we get to the playoffs and we see him play, if he does play, because you know he had to uh, curse the little B curse. <laughs> so if that's lifted off God, of him, the yeah, God the, the base guy curse, if that's lifted off of him and he does well in the playoffs, then he'll get the MVP there. But I think regular if you're season, actual MVP, you should be MVP all the way through to Thanks. the end. I agree, but not making excuses for him, but like he is kind of carrying an entire team, and that's a lot of pressure on somebody Like once it gets into that point in the playoffs. I feel like there's you know? no reason that Giannis shouldn't win the – that Giannis should not win the MVP. Personally, I feel like that Giannis has developed into a player that we didn't look at in the beginning. We didn't look at Giannis Antetokounmpo. Sure. We didn't think Giannis Antetokounmpo would be the player that he is now. You know what I'm saying? We thought, just, oh, who is this tall, slim guy on the Bucks? Oh, he's okay. He might develop into someone that we might can talk about later. But this dude is playing like a grown man, okay? Yeah. He has the Mamba mentality. When you train him with the best, <laughs> you're going to play like the best. And he trained with Kobe Bryant. Mamba. So, I mean, look at him. And I when the Bucks and the Rockets went head-to-head, -head, I mean, Giannis had better stats than James Harden did. So, I, I mean. Think, exactly. Hmm. I still I, say exactly. James. I'm still giving it to James because Giannis has more developing to do. Now, did he develop quickly? Yes. yes. Did he play? Did he work out with Kobe last yes. summer? Yes. But who doesn't work out with Kobe or Not Hakeem a Elijah Wan or whoever they somebody, go to? Dominique yeah. Wilkins. Yeah. Everybody's they go to have somebody some kind of and they work out and they say, okay, we got better. But we're not seeing just getting better. James Harden is the MVP this season. Okay, don't get me wrong. He recorded his 57th 30-plus uh, point game. 57. 57? Okay. 57. But here's yeah, the 57, thing. 30 points. Do you hear you that? Can have, <laughs> like, like, Do you, you hear that? Let's just talk about that I mean, for a second. That's, that's yeah. cool, though, but you I mean, like. You can have 50 plus point games, but you're easy. talking about the man gets like 18 free throws a game. Like, you can't help that, though. I mean, it's the way he plays. <laughs> okay, you if you feel like if I, if the guy, if no. I'm getting the ball and I'm taking like six steps and then somebody just, oh my No, God, that's I'm, the refs not yeah. calling the travel, but the guys defending him, if you're going to have your hands He's extended for a long time, that, and I'm hanging out, hand out for him. Oh if God. that works for him, let him do it. Let, let him do it. It's it easy. It's easy for James to get to the line. He's a good player. That's why it's easy. Are you kidding me? When you have 18 free throw attempts and the next highest is five seriously that's not his honestly if that's how he's gonna play that's how it's work it works that's for him basketball. It, that is not basketball he can't that's control what the fat. refs do in me and you <laughs> but like, you have to do you have to make as a defender you have to make certain um Certain changes when it comes to defending you know, James Harden because yes, exactly. you know that he's gonna that exactly. he's gonna that go into the lane you he's have gonna to get the call why don't you back up play defense with your legs move your feet 
You don't like have you to, learn you don't that have to put in your hands Pee-wee in. But it's like you exactly. breathe on James Harden and you're going to get a foul. If you breathe on Kobe, you would have got a foul too. No, so you there, would not there we go with the Kobe easy. working out together. It he, been he finally yeah, found yeah, out how to get the that foul. Kobe we'll we'll check about MVP next season. Kobe wouldn't have got to the line as easy as James Harden Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Kobe Bryant. They're actually basically walking James Harden to the line. That's not James Harden's problem, though. That's not James Harden's problem. getting soft. It's like a little pillow. It's getting soft, but I mean, you can't you can't control what the rest of the And it's not even call. the NBA. It's just him. But can it's you blame him, him though? Can you really him. blame him though? It's because it works for him. Game. He's done yeah. it. He's done it his no entire career. Change. He's yeah. cold. He's he's he, he he's by far one of the best shooters. So right Giannis now. is your he's MVP cool. over James because yes. of what though? Look at what Okay. Giannis has that leadership mentality. Leadership mentality, excuse me. He has a leadership mentality. If you were to take Let's just say, if you were to take Giannis away from the Bucks, the Bucks would be cool. Take James Harden away from the, from from uh, the Rockets. Is there they're going downhill? I agree. How they, are they going I downhill? Agree. They have who Clint else could they have? Who they else have, they score? They have Clint Capella. They have uh-uh. Eric but Gordon. They have PJ speaking, Tucker. Uh-uh. They have Austin yes. Rivers. They uh-uh. have a litany of you guys who they need to. <laughs> no, you got it. I was. I looked shoot, earlier. No, per, can't shoot. per 100 points or per 100 um, shots per game. I think it was the w- without uh, Giannis on the court, the Bucks scored 13 less points on average. With James Harden, the Rockets only were four points difference. And so like it comes down to it. So. James Harden. Okay, okay. <laughs> we can't we're, get gonna, James we're not going to agree on this. <laughs> thank you, panel, and thank you for tuning in to LUTV Sports Break. Be sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter for more Lamar University sports. We'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs>